Hello guys and welcome playing the Fisherman Beta. A lot of fish here, 12 different species and I was able to catch 3 different uniques and a trophy whilst catfish. I got a unique Xander, unique Bream and unique European Perch. So I'm gonna go over those for the Perch, the Xander, the Bream and the whilst catfish. But there are in general 12 different species here and out of 12 10 come in unique tier so a lot of fish to be going for the weather patterns are like this you have sunny partly cloudy partly sunny and you have cloudy i've tried them all and i tried the nights and it's all good uh, you get action in all peak hours no complaints there whatsoever. I came here with three different setups, a lure setup, bower setup and feeder setup. Starting with the whole catfish over here at the rocket domination. I was able to do it during night time with the feeder setup and I also used small crickets. Small crickets is what larva actually it's small cricket larva. This is what got me the trophy well catfish going going over here it's very deep there's nothing to it just night hours as always is best it's just looking for the deep spots it's very deep here it's over six meters uh, this is about six meters. there are spots that are deeper than that and plenty of catfish on this spot and here is the clip with catching the trophy catfish. Alright, going to the next one, I want to do the European Perch, the unique one, actually I got over here at the Southern Viaduct. I was a little bit surprised, but spawning at the bridge, there is a little trail, you walk down and to the very end of the map, there isn't anything else on it, so you can walk, it feels like a hike, but... I walked it to the very end. I was also curious to see what's what's there. And here it is. Coming over here, you see the the orange tubes or whatever that is, the buoys that are floating there, indicating that's the end of the map. You can't cast it. And there is some lily pads on that side. You can tell there is a dead tree or a log and I was casting it anywhere over here close to the lily pads between the lily pads and the log area. I don't have the marker for it but I caught it on the bottom setup, feeder setup with hook size 1 and small minnows. This is where I got the unique European perch. And here is the clip for it.
All right, now catching the unique Bream and the unique Zander. These two, actually going at the Sandy Riviera. This place is action packed. There is European Perch, um, Common Roach was somewhere here. This is the new one, Common Nays, I think, or Nas, whatever it's called. Here you go, Trophy Common Roach. Again, the other one. And here is some unique Common Bream. Um, this one came on Bloodworms. And there was another one I got that was on Maggots. So, here you go. There is another one a little bit closer to the shore. So maggots and bloodworms work on it and then the things I noticed using different type of hook I'll end up catching different fish so I was mainly going for the bream, the unique bream and hook size 1, 2 and 4 all got me uniques. When I have the hook size 1 I'll also end up catching a little bit bigger fish like barbel even if it's closer. If I use the little guys here hook size 4, I end up also catching some of the smaller fish, so it's a mixed bag, I cannot filter out and do just bream, it's just not possible, too much fish here. And in the end, using the, the lure setup, I actually used the same spoon that works at the Netherlands map, this one, and it works like a charm. The medium spoon 14 gram, rose and blue. This one casting it as far as possible and just doing stop and go from here a little bit to the left to here and I'll end up catching either Xander or Northern Pike. Stay tuned guys for more videos. I'm planning on going to the Everglades map and test out all the uniques there and see if the time frames are still legit if it still works and do some bitcoin farming and see if i can get anything over there i'm balkan cheers and take care